science another subject that gives student the jitter during exams but i'll not let that jittery feeling bother you and we are going to prepare for the exam that we have on 22nd of march as far as the syllabus is concerned we have got two chapters in the chemistry portion making up 23 marks the chapter carbon and its compound it is very important to do the friendly nature of carbon and the covalency of carbon and we know the reason behind it yes tetravalency and catenation we need to write for a one mark question and for two mark or more we need to explain these now the next thing is allotropy which is very important the homologous series IUPAC nomenclature and the all the reactions that is shown by the hydrocarbons now turn on to page number 72 of your NCRT book and move on till page number 74 you will find the topics ethanol and ethanoic acid very very important two topics and one question will be surely there in this year's paper either in the form of MCQ or in the form of a descriptive question so read on these uh, two pages very carefully do not leave even a single line from these two pages okay moving on we have soaps and detergent we know examiners all-time favorite so prepare these things from this chapter the next chapter we have with us is the periodic classification of elements we know the D and M's are important yes the Dobrenier, the Newland and the Mendeleev periodic table the achievements and the limitation we know why Mendeleev periodic table was rejected yes the reason where the incorrect assumption of arrangement of all the elements by virtue of their atomic masses no place for isotopes and incorrect arrangement of hydrogen so that is the reason why modern periodic table came into existence and as far as the modern periodic table is concerned you need to know how to find the address of an element remember the Bohr and Burry rule for that okay and after that you need to know all the trends that these elements follow in the modern periodic table so this is what we have in the chemistry portion now moving on to the biology portion we have got two chapters again 30 marks from the chapter reproduction we have got five modes of asexual reproduction binary fusion budding spore formation regeneration and vegetative propagation one question will surely be there out of these five modes of asexual reproduction so prepare very well now this chapter is very important as far as the diagrams are concerned so you need to draw well labeled diagrams the important diagrams that we have in this chapter are the human male and female reproductive organs and the structure of flower remember you need to draw well labeled neat and clean diagrams if in case you tend to forget the labelings because labelings are very important you cannot afford to miss it half mark is for one labeling so if you forget the labeling so for this one the structure of flower what I used to do is I'm a foodie person so I remember the names by actually remembering sweet pudding salty avocado fries pasta with sesame sauce olive and oregano simple the next section is physics 29 marks two chapters the first chapter is light therein you need to remember how to draw the real diagrams of the two types of lenses and mirrors that we have in our syllabus and we know the uh, underlying principle behind the construction of ray diagram only two principles are there refraction of light and reflection of light as far as the numerical portion is concerned do practice questions on lens formula and mirror formula very well remember the sign convention object distance is by default negative and for image distance and focal length you need to answer as per the situation given in the question the last important thing on this chapter is the power of lens moving on to the next chapter which is human eye and the colorful world again the label diagram of human eye is very important prepare accordingly then the defects of vision very very important we have got three defects of vision in our syllabus myopia hypermetropia and 
express biopia. We need to focus on the causes and the correctness of these disease. The next important thing from this chapter and you can pretty much expect at least one question either out of formation of rainbow or twinkling of stars or advanced sunset and delayed sunrise. So that was in the physics portion. The last portion of the syllabus is ecology making up 8 marks. Two chapters we have the natural resources from the chapter natural resources prepare ecosystem, food chain and food web. If a value based question is asked from this chapter, formulate your answer on the lines of your ethics as an individual towards your society and towards the sustenance of mankind. The last chapter of this section and in fact of the entire course is the management of natural resources. Questions which are important are the three R's which is reduce, recycle and reuse water harvesting, coal and petroleum and sustainable management. So prepare these topics very well and you are going to do wonderful in your exams. All the best.